Basically what the Planck Apoch is, is a finite unit of space and time that cannot be broken down any farther. This would imply that time and space are not actually continuous and that they're, they haven't even been already written, but they are actually slowly loading bit by bit or being created bit by bit. This would make an uh, analogy, uh, this would work combined with the time dilation to give uh, an analogy of our universe being a computer simulation for two reasons. One of which, time is the holder effectively of information in our universe. Without time and space, um, without time, um, nothing could happen and therefore we would have no means of being able to record information or even view how the universe worked. So that would be effectively the, the information loading you the universe as it happened. The second analogy um, which makes this work is the fact that, um, again, what with the, uh, the universe being, you know, with time and space loading in this hypothetical theory, um, we, the, compu the universe could even freeze, uh, like sometimes like a computer does, like these new Windows Vista programs and other stuff, and we, um, as the bits or what have you on, the, on our level, would not even realize that it happened because we were inside the program. We're inside the universe. Anyway, more in the next video.